for Mathematics 5, we are already in quarter 4, week 5. We are going to have the topic, Converting Units of Measurement in Volume. Wherein, we are going to specifically talk us about converting cubic centimeter to cubic meter and vice versa and cubic centimeter to liter and vice versa. Our objective, at the end of this lesson, you are expected to convert cubic centimeter to cubic meter and vice versa and cubic centimeter to liter and vice versa. This lesson intends to help you gain an understanding on converting cubic centimeter to cubic meter and vice versa and cubic centimeter to liter and vice versa with knowledge in the rules and converting smaller unit to bigger or higher unit and vice versa. As our preliminary activity, let us do the following. Directions, convert the following units. Try guessing the letter of the correct answer. Revealing the correct answer through the game, which is hit or miss. So in doing the hit or miss, let us try to answer the following questions. Number one, how many cubic centimeters are there in two cubic meters? Number two, if you get the equivalent of 45 cubic meters to cubic centimeters, what would the answer be? Number three, 35 million cubic centimeter is equal to how many cubic meters? And number four, if we have convert 7,300,000 cubic centimeter to cubic meters, the answer is 73 cubic meters. Number five, 25 cubic centimeter is equal to how many cubic meters? To further understand our lesson, we have here a problem. This problem talks about conversion. In order to find out how are we going to convert, let us now try to study this problem. As the COVID-19 cases continue to rise, Anna and Alan were getting bored at home. So, their father bought them a rectangular aquarium and different types of fish for them to enjoy while staying at home. The aquarium is 20 centimeters long, 15 centimeters wide, and 20 centimeters high. But first, the siblings need to fill up the aquarium with 4 liters of water. What is its equivalent value in cubic centimeters? How much water in cubic centimeters can the aquarium hold? Will the aquarium be able to hold the 4 liters water? The problem wants to determine the capacity of the aquarium in terms of amount of water to be poured in that is within its limit. In comparing two quantities, they have to be in the same unit of measurement. When one given is in cubic meters, the others must be in cubic meters too. Otherwise, you need to convert. Let us study the following example. Let's convert 1 cubic meter to cubic centimeters, wherein we can see that 1 cubic meter is equal to 100 cubic meter multiplied by itself for 3 times. So when you multiply 100 times 100, times 100, you will arrive at 1 million cubic centimeter. So, the answer would be 1 cubic meter is equal to 1 million cubic centimeters.
Now, if you are going to convert 1 cubic centimeter to cubic meter, you are going to do the reverse. So there, 1 cubic centimeter is equal to 1 over 100 centimeters to the third power, wherein when you multiply 100 three times, that becomes 1 million. 1 million, uh, 1 divided by 1 million becomes 0 0.00001 cubic meters. But the volume of liquids are usually in milliliters and liters. So we need to learn how to convert cubic centimeters and cubic meters into milliliters or liters. Note that each cubic centimeter or 1 cc or 1 cubic meter is equal to 1 milliliter. So when we convert 1 liter to cubic centimeters, that becomes 1 liter times 100 milliliters over 1 is equal to 1,000 milliliters. So it means to say there is 1,000 cubic centimeter for every 1 liter, which is also equivalent to 1,000 milliliters. Learning from our previous examples, now it's your turn. Convert 1 cubic meter to liters by filling out the missing value that will make the equation true. Take note of the following. In multiplying a whole number to a fraction, multiply the whole number to the numerator and copy the denominator. Like in our given example, the whole number is 5 multiplied by 1 over 6. Since then, we are going to multiply 5 by 1 is equal to 5 and then copy the denominator which is 6. While in multiplying two fractions, multiply the numerator to numerator and denominator to denominator. 1 liter is equal to 1,000 cubic centimeter. Now convert 1 cubic centimeter to liters. So we have 1 cubic centimeter is equal to 1 cubic centimeter times 1 over 1,000 cubic centimeter is equal to 1 over 1,000 divided 1 divided by 1,000 is equal to 0 0.00 0.001 liters. Let us study the relationship between some units of measurement below. Do you see any pattern? 1 cubic meter is equal to 1 million cubic centimeter. And 1 cubic centimeter is equal to 0 0.00. 0.0001 cubic meters, while 1 liter is equal to 1,000 cubic centimeter, and 1 cubic centimeter is equal to 0 0.001 liters. When converting from larger or bigger unit to a smaller unit, use multiplication. When converting from a small unit to a larger or bigger unit, use division. The mnemonic device below can help us go about the conversion. Now that we already know how to convert, let us do this activity 1. Directions, select the appropriate conversions of the following numbers. Write the letters of the answer on the blank before the number. For activity 2, we have happy or sad. Directions, write the happy face if the conversion is correct and put the sad face if it is incorrect. You have done great. Now we come up with a generalization. From our previous discussion, answer the following. 1. How will we convert volume of cubic meter to liters or milliliters and vice versa? Number 2. 
how do you convert from a bigger or larger unit to a smaller unit of measurement? And three, how do you convert from a smaller unit to a bigger or larger unit of measurement? We now arrive with our assessment. Directions, convert the following units. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Now we have our reflection. Based on what you have learned from today's lesson, complete the sentence below. Today, I have learned that blank is needed in order to compare quantities of different measurements. 